With two games left in the regular season, the Liberty Flames welcome in the Camel Camels for a pivotal Big South men's soccer match on Wednesday night. After a scoreless first half, the Flames were able to scratch across two goals in the second and secure a 2-1 win to improve to 5-3 in the Big South. Here's some of the sights and sounds from the players and coaches after Liberty's big win on Wednesday night. We, we felt we were on top of the game going into the half. Thought we were unfortunate not to be up a goal. Uh, their keeper made a couple timely saves. We missed a couple, but we just continued to talk about the guys getting the ball wide, getting the ball in good spots, and then making harder runs in the box. And sure enough, we got the ball wide. Troy Reeves hits a great serve. Tyler Bullock beats his guy, and we score, you know, probably one of the best goals we've scored all year. For us, it seems like we always make it hard on ourselves. When we get the lead, we got 20 minutes left for some reason. You know, we make it tough on ourselves, but we always battle it out and um, usually get the win. So we're proud of our team. I feel like, you know, we really bossed the first half. The, really, the, the thing that was missing was just in the final third, um, just actually getting a goal, you know, to kind of put the game away, um, just kind of take advantage. So we just needed to take advantage of our chances because we knew we were creating good opportunities. We just needed to, you know, change that in the second half and finish one. I thought we showed the composure, the resiliency that we've talked about all year, and, and, and bending and not breaking. And, and we talked about it before the game. Every time the bell has rung, we've answered the bell. So they scored, tied it, game on. We, we answered the bell and scored a second goal. That was fantastic. But I was very proud of our composure the last 10 or 12 minutes because we closed the game out like we'd been training to close the game out.